Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a summer vacay haul. I'm going on vacation. I need a vacation. It's been warmer and kind of like hot here in Illinois, but listen, your girl need a break, okay? I just need to hop on a plane and be in somebody else's state with some water. Of course, you guys know I'm gonna to talk to you guys about Shopping Smart because that is what we do. We make sure that we calculate, okay? We keep track of sales. We remember what's coming back in stock, okay? How do we do that? Of course, Shop Tagger. If you have not seen a video where I talked about Shop Tagger before, today you are in luck because you're gonna learn all about how I like to shop smart online. This is what I do. People ask me what I do in my spare time. I shop online. The best way and the easiest way to do that is to use the Shop Tagger app. If you do not know what Shop Tagger is, it is a browser app and a phone app. It's like your smart shopping assistant. It helps you to remember when things come back in stock or when they go on sale. It'll remind you, it'll send you emails, it'll also ping you on your phone or on your computer if you opt into those notifications. I've been using it for about two, three years now and I'm telling you like it helps me save money. I cannot tell you how many times Shop Tiger has saved me because something came back in stock that I was really wanting, but it went out of stock. And for those of you who do already use Shop Tiger, there is an update. They just updated it. They have a new look and feel. So I'm going to go ahead and share with you guys how to download the app, how it works, and we'll get right back to the haul. Okay, we'll go into the haul, show you guys what I got. So it's really simple. All you're going to do is go to shoptiger.com and download the button. You can sign up for free or you can log in if you already have an account and download the browser button from the Google Chrome store. And after you install the button, you just head to one of your favorite stores. You click the button or slider where you see an item that you'd like to save. You could just save whatever item you like. You can put it in your what kind of notifications you want to get. And you can save it to different lists. So you can make a list for, you know, um, if you're going somewhere or if you have an occasion that you want to save items to that list for. And it'll help you organize everything. And also there's a new feature now where you can view coupon codes at checkout. So if you put something in your cart and check out it will offer you some coupon codes if it can find some and that's pretty much it so if you guys want to check out top tagger be sure to click the link in the description box and go ahead and download it for yourself okay. we are going to go through the stuff now let me just tell y'all I have a lot of color here don't be alarmed the older I get the more colorful I get um, I've always loved color but there was a phase in my life where I was like trying to be like everybody else and wanted to wear nudes and black and white all the time didn't work okay tried it failed actually i'm gonna start with my shoes since they're already down here if you guys don't know i have like been in the sneaker mode this year i don't know what happened but like this year i've like been way more obsessed with sneakers than i usually am these are the nike react presto and this is a combination of the nike presto upper and the nike react bottom so if you guys know anything about nike sneakers they have different makes and models of their sneakers and this one is a hybrid of two different styles of Nike shoe. They're so comfortable. I've got big feet and I've got flat feet. And my feet do not like flat shoes. I cannot wear flip flops. I cannot wear flat sandals at all. So summertime, I'm still wearing sneakers. Um, and I usually go for a lighter pair. Um, this one has like a breathable mesh upper. I do not wear sneakers with socks, so don't judge me, but I will not be wearing socks with these because I want to make sure my feet don't get hot. Yes, some good walking shoes. Probably gonna wear those to the airport. Good, need a good airport sneaker. I try not to get cheap shoes because my feet can't handle it. I just can't, okay? I only get one pair of feet. Oh, and you can find those sneakers at Dick's Sporting Goods. I'll put a link down below. I got two pair of Air Force Ones. Don't judge me, but when these came out, I was like so so excited about them because you guys know I love bright colors already okay but bright colors are in like it's just in to wear super laser neon highlighter bright shoes I got two pair of the Nike Air Force ones that came out in these really bright colorways um, this is laser fuchsia you you cannot tell me this color is not gorgeous like it looks like a marker that I would like color with all the time. I don't know what color, but it just, it's fuchsia. Fuchsia is becoming one of my faves, okay? New color alert. This orange is really, really cute. Um, my girl Symphony had these on her Instagram story, and I was like, sis, I was just looking at the pink ones. Now I feel like I should get the orange ones too. She was like, sis, get them. And I was like, okay. Uh, I probably would wear them like this, like 
two different colors <laughs> at one time. Anything under $100 is like a steal to me. So a Nike shoe for 90 bucks, definitely can't skip out on it. Everybody loves Air Force Ones. Get the stomping in my Air Force Ones. I love Nordstrom's customer service and their return policy is amazing. I love shopping online at Nordstrom because I get my points and um, credit. <laughs> I did get some sandals. Now, once upon a time, I did say the only sandals that I really trusted with arch support were the Birkenstocks Jesus sandals. And I have actually found a lot of different kind of shoes that I do like um, <laughs> that give a little bit more of sass and a little less Jesus. Not that we don't need more Jesus, but you know. This bright green though is amazing. Um, they are like, a patent but they're actually very very soft and they're very very sturdy like you can't really like bend them that much but also i really like that they have a really good arch support here um that's pretty sturdy so it's gonna hold my foot but i love sandal shapes like this i know a lot of people don't like the mom sandal these are definitely a mom who gardens style shoe i personally think they're really really cute i love my tevas so i thought i'd give the jeffrey campbell ones a try and i mean the color is worth it is it not they also have like um a neon pink a neon yellow um a black white so they have a lot of different colors these are on um nordstrom for 119 that is a lot for a sandal but i mean nordstrom notes i couldn't pass this up <laughs> if you guys don't know one of my favorite 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 stores to shop at online is zappos if you guys can see here Oh, it's upside down. Okay. Um, they always give you free returns, free exchanges. You have a year, 365 days to return your item. A whole year to return? Are you kidding me? Um, and the shipping is free both ways. Zappos is the goat. Okay. I got two pair of Doc Martin sandals. Now, I do like both shoes, so I can't decide which one. Maybe you guys can help me out. I can't decide which one I like better, but this is the first sandal. This is, I believe this is the Clarissa. I'll put the names of everything down in the description box, but these are the first one. Now, these have like just regular straps. It's leather. This sole is very, very chunky and it's very heavy. I don't mind it being heavy. I don't mind wearing clunky sandals. I feel like they will help my foot to feel more cushioned and comfortable throughout the day because you get so much bounce and resistance. They're gonna help me with support, if anything. This is the Nartilla in black. They do wrap around the ankle, so they have like an ankle uh, tie-up, lace-up situation. These are more lightweight. Like these are very, very light. The sole is just as soft. It's just a lighter shoe. These were only 100 or 105 something like that um but these i believe were like 130 um i mean i like both of them though so i feel like if anything i might keep both of them see which ones i wear and if i don't wear one of them i'll just send that one back um because i have 365 days to make my decision so we got time sis moving forward i'm going to go into my clothes let's just get into this new discovery that i have made because i mean do I even have to talk about ASOS? I love ASOS because they have everything that you need, obviously. They have maternity, they have plus, they have curve, they have petite, they have tall. Y'all be sleep on the men's section. They be having some really good sales. And I actually came across these really super bright, colorful men's swimming trunks. And I was thinking, you know what? These will be cute as shorts. And I'm just like in awe because I'm like, why didn't I think of this before? This is genius. They come in the cutest colors. Like I've got this super bright, fuchsia to go with my fuchsia sneaks i also got this orange to go with my orange sneaks and then we got fuchsia and orange for when we want to wear both shoes at once hey hello so this is a two extra small and extra extra small um and they fit me perfectly like i don't even have to tie the waist they fit perfectly on me i feel like men's clothing is just constructed better because they have more stuff to hold you know we've got the pock on the back and it's got velcro so that's convenient i can put like my wallet or something in here you got pockets on the sides and then they have like the brief on the inside so if you did want to go commando if you wanted to be free willy you could probably will still wear underwear though but i think that this is amazing and i could probably swim in these too because they're swim trunks so they're dual purpose you just can't go wrong i got some cute tops this is a mesh t-shirt kind of top it's cute, it's got like a mock neck, but it's got like a see-through kind of mesh. It's not really see-through, like you can see through it, but not like 
anything crazy crazy this would be cute to wear over like a swimsuit top you know what i'm saying or just like a bra um like a bralette or something that i want to show uh but it is kind of long so it could double as a swimsuit cover-up and i just love it i think it's super cute it was 29 um but like i said asos has great sales so i was able to get a little bit money off of this one because I, I bought it during the sale but yeah this will be really cute with my bright green sandals y'all see how this is coming together i love it already this is like a little crop top one shoulder the 2000s are coming back if you guys haven't noticed we're all about to be out here looking like a 2004 r&b video um asos has really good swimsuits now let me just go ahead and give you guys the rundown and spiel about these swimsuits obviously i'm not gonna be trying them on because you guys know i'm not what i look like i just want you guys to know that this fits perfectly it is an itty bitty teeny weeny black and reflective polka dot spot bikini she itty bitty all right we about to be out here with our bitties out i'm going on vacation and also i'm gonna be getting a tan and i want minimal tan lines so <laughs> so this is a reflective bikini and this is what the bottom looks like now what i will say about asos bikinis is that i feel like they're better quality than some of the other bikinis like this that i've bought i bought some bikinis from um pretty little thing and i don't have all of them because i had to send the bottoms back because they were way too big and i'm thinking oh pretty little thing is cheap you know i could just get me some bikinis or whatever um because it's not really that big of a deal i don't really need a whole lot of coverage because i just want some like little baby bikinis um for my little tts like can you see like how flimsy and like the drawstring part like it draws but it doesn't like i don't know it doesn't like bunch up cute I don't know trying it on I wasn't impressed with the quality not that I should be because it was a cheap bikini that top was like what five dollars but the way that this is structured like it, it just feels like the line it has more lining um the drawstring is more sturdy you can spread it if you want more coverage in the back or if you're trying to be you know if you're trying to be real spicy out here and you want a little thongish action going on I don't know I just feel like these fit me a lot better it wouldn't hurt to spend a little bit more money on your bikini okay because you do want the amount of coverage that you need you want it to fit right you want it to look right because it, it is a little piece of fabric it's gonna have to fit your body right because when it hits the water you don't want it to be sliding all over the place and acting funky and that's why i'm scared about these pretty little thing ones because i feel like even though they were inexpensive and they were just cute for the moment kind of thing they may not work for me it's cute but it's so thin the material is so thin and I just, I don't know, I'm a little scared. But I just want to let y'all know what I, my little feels about Pretty Little Thing and their sometimey stuff. Okay, another bikini that I got from ASOS. I got this one. This is a high waist bottom. It's super cute. High waist bottom. It's bright coral with blue piping. And then this is the top. The top is really cute too. I'm going to post a picture on the side of the screen so y'all can see how it looks. It goes like this across the titties and then across the neck. It crisscrosses in the front. Crisscross will make you jump. And then I also got a cover up. This is like a super neon pink top that like, you know, it wraps around. And then the pants like so. Now they are see-through, but it's gonna be really cute to wear like my swimsuit underneath. Now you guys know tie-dye is in. I have a lot of tie-dye that I've been buying in the past couple months. This is a tie-dye dress, so cute. It'll be cute as a cover-up, but I also think it'll be really cute to wear, you know, as like a dress. Breezy, fun, quick, to throw on kind of dress. I thought that was really cute and it was on sale. I don't remember how much it was, but I believe it was less than $20. And then I got this really cute jumpsuit. You see how this fabric is so flowy? It's gonna be really, really comfortable to wear. And this one's a little more saved for the saints. This is when we go like to dinner or something with mom and dad, you know what I mean? It's super cute, I love it. It was worth the money to me. Okay, so that's the stuff that I got from ASOS. I think that's everything from ASOS, I think. I'm gonna go on to Urban Outfitters. Urban doesn't have the best prices, but they have really good sales. Um, they had a sale recently on um, some of their summer items. So I was able to pick out some cute stuff, including this top. I got this shirt because you guys know I love Sonic and a lot of y'all who've been following me forever, y'all always reference Sonic. Um, this is like my ode to you guys. This is like nostalgic. I did this for you. I got two tops on sale. These were like $11 each, I want to say. Kind of see-through. I literally just tried this one on because I was going to wear it in this video. This is the first one. It is like a see-through mesh kind of top with like a ringer. It's like a ringer top, but it's a crop top. And I got a lime one. It's the exact same top, just in the lime color. I also got this bodysuit that's kind of similar. It has like the ringer, the white ring around everything. Um, and it's got like a mesh in the back. 
it has an open back and front stomach part it does have a thong back I do plan on wearing like some really cute pants with this. I'm not gonna have my cheeks just hanging out, okay? We don't do that around here. And these will be cute with my Presto Reacts as well. So, uh, like I said, options. I know Stussy in particular typically does not go on sale on, on Urban Outfitters site. Um, so these were not, these were regular priced. Please hold. Um, they did come in a set with like the shorts and the vest. I just got the shorts cause I was trying to be, you know, a little frugal I wasn't trying to spend all my money but these shorts are amazing the utility trend is in right now everything is like a utility um so I've been really into utility I mean I like utility anyways I've always loved like cargo styles because I'm a sporty gal so these were right up my alley they're like they were in the women's section though they're like women's shorts you can't go wrong right like I can wear this with this bodysuit I can wear this with this top I can wear this with this top like I mean, all the colors are in there, so I don't have to worry about not matching. This is a Urban Renewal item. And I don't know, I'm kind of iffy about Urban Renewal items because they're typically like vintage items that they just like reworked and made like new. Um, so this is like a men's polo that they cut and made it to a crop top. It was on sale for 20 bucks. I feel like that was a good steal because it is polo. Just cropped and made all nice and clean at the bottom, not like frayed and you know what I mean? Like when you just cut something yourself. I couldn't do this so I feel like it was worth it for me so has a tag on it so I always try to you know make sure I leave the tags on things just in case like I will take stuff on a whole vacation won't wear it bring it back and then take it back <laughs> you know just trying to make sure I get my money's worth out of things if I don't get my money's worth I'm sending it back okay I also got this top these were like kind of cheap it's originally like 20 bucks but it was on sale for like nine dollars so I got this it's just like one of those halter tops ties in the back and um around the neck and it's blue I don't have anything like navy blue um I don't know why I got this color I don't really know I just kind of like oh I don't have anything blue so let me get something blue but kind of regretting that I might not wear that one either I might send them back but these are cute okay I like these I'm keeping these all right these are some like knit basketball shorts they were described as knit basketball shorts on the website they were sitting in my wish list for a little while and then the sale happened and I was like, this is happening, I'm buying them. I don't know, you guys know I'm weird though. I like wearing weird stuff. I mean, I won't wear anything, but I will wear the stuff that you won't. So I, I think this will be cute, you know, with my sneaks and like a crop top or even like if I just wore this like as a swimsuit cover up, just cover up the bottom and wear it with like a, my triangle bikini top, you know, it'll look real 90s, real throwback. I don't know, I just love these. I love everything about them. Um, oh, I got this from ASOS too. I actually wore this when I went to Texas for Memorial Day, um, but I only like wore it for like a couple hours and then took it off. But this is a jumpsuit and it's red tie dye. It was on sale. Um, it's really cute. I'm planning on wearing that again on vacation because it is cute, even though um, my body's weird because I'm short, but I have like a long body, like a long torso. Like when I sit down, it like the crotch like rides up and it be hurting. You know, it is a little tight in that area as far as like the length wise goes. It's a little tight, um, but it's cute though. So I kept it. It's cute. I believe it's still on sale. I'm going to try to find it because it was fairly expensive, inexpensive. It was like 20 bucks or less. I got some stuff from Forever 21. I went today because there was a sale online but I actually wanted to look in store to see the stuff that I was going to get because you know sometimes buying stuff online with Forever 21 is kind of a hit or miss because you don't really know the quality when you see it you know in person it kind of be looking a little different. I did end up buying a little swimsuit top it was really cheap it was two for 15 they didn't have a black bottom to go with it so I don't know what I'm going to wear on the bottom but it's just a little string bikini top. I got this really cute tunic. I believe I can wear this as a swimsuit cover up, but it would be really cute on its own with like some shorts. It is very long and wide, but I like it because it's kind of oversized and breezy, but it's got like palm trees. I feel like this is real Miami. This is a little cute little number. Um, it's a strapless, but it is very stretchy. I feel like this is gonna make my booty look real nice when I go on my date with my man. Slide it on real quick. Cause you know it's Bay's birthday next week, so I gotta look. I gotta look right and tight for my man. You know what I'm saying? Oh, but yes. You know it hugs in all the right places. Okay. 
I believe that's all for my clothing. Um, and then, oh, accessories. So I do have some accessories. Got some new jewels, some new baubles from Bobble Bar. So I got some new rainbow rings from Bobble Bar. They're really, really cute. I got these from uh, Nordstrom, actually. Nordstrom has a nice little selection of Bobble Bar stuff. So I got two new rainbow rings. They also have a set of colorful rings that I really like. You can put on different fingers. And I love stacking my bracelets, giving you like that throwback from when we used to make beaded bracelets all the time and stuff, friendship bracelets, things like that. If you like bright, colorful, whimsical jewelry, Baba Bar has a really great selection. Um, and then also I got some sunglasses. If you go to Urban a lot, you probably know that Urban Outfitters has a really good selection of inexpensive sunglasses. So I got these. These were only like 20 bucks, I think. Bright, neon, colorful sunglasses. I also got some sunglasses from Amazon. These sunglasses from Amazon, I think these are really like in style right now. I believe YSL has a pair of sunglasses like this. They're like the heart shaped. But these were $10, or wait, no. Was it 10 or 15? 10 or 15 for a set of two. Prime your life, sis. Like, these are really, really cheap. That is it for this video. That's it for this haul. I'll see you guys in my next video. Uh, and that's it. Be sure to check the description box for all the links to everything. And link to Chop Tagger. And I'll see you soon.